My name is Lisa, a hardworking corporate employee dedicated to both love and work. The job that used to make me whine when I was a new graduate has now become second nature to me, to the point where I can train newcomers. I've been maintaining a steady relationship with my boyfriend, whom I've been dating since college, and I'm leading a fulfilling life. Although I had a desire to get married, I was thinking of enjoying this lifestyle for now. Then one day, while I was on a date with my boyfriend Gachia. Lisa. Please try spinning this homemade gacha machine I made. What? You made this, Gachia. The handle and everything looks so real. But it seems like there's only one capsule in it. Never mind that, just give it a try. Wow, it really feels like I'm using a machine in a store, huh? Is that a ring inside the capsule? Lisa, will you marry me? Gachia! I'm so happy! Yes, I will! The man who poured his passion into this gacha is my boyfriend, Gachia. I was very surprised by the unexpected proposal, but even more delighted, and from that day on, I began to dream about married life every day. After completing the marriage introductions with both families, we started preparing for the ceremony. Hmm. I like the color of this dress, and the design of that one is lovely. Haha, <laughs> women have so many choices. It's easy for men, we just need to match the suit with the dress. It's hard to decide with so many options. What I like and what suits me might be different. Any dress would look good on you, Lisa. Oh, Gachia. Thank you. With preparations for the wedding going smoothly, everything was set to proceed without a hitch. However, on the day of the wedding, Gachia, the groom, disappeared, and we had to cancel the ceremony abruptly. Everyone was confused by the sudden turn of events, and since then, there has been no contact with Gachia. Six years have passed since that day. Lisa. Over here. Can you see me? Kokoa. Phew, I'm glad we found each other. I haven't been to a fireworks show in so long, I got lost. It seems there are more people this year, apparently there's a lot of buzz about the new fireworks. Is that so? I'm getting excited just waiting for it to start. The person I promised to watch the fireworks with is my friend Kokoa. We work at the same place and are close in age, so we've been good friends since I joined the company. Then one day. It's been a while since we've met outside of work, Kokoa. Thanks for inviting me to dinner today. I know, right? It's been busy lately. But I wanted to share some important news with you in person. Important news? Kokoa, could it be? Actually, I'm getting married. Yay! Congratulations! I thought it was just around the corner, I'm so happy for you. Thank you. I'll invite you to the wedding, so you must come. Of course. I'm looking forward to it. It seems Kokoa is getting married, and she has invited me to the ceremony. Kokoa has bright, clear eyes and distinct facial features. She will surely look like a doll in her wedding dress. I was very much looking forward to seeing her in her moment of glory. However, on the day of the wedding, I witnessed a shocking scene. The bride and groom will be appearing soon. I wonder what kind of dress she chose. She has good taste in clothes, so she must have chosen something wonderful. I'm excited. Thank you for waiting. Now, please welcome the groom. Oh. Here it comes. I wonder what Kokoa's husband is like. I've heard about him, but I've never seen his picture. Since Kokoa is cute, maybe her husband is of a similar type. Here comes the groom. Ha ha. Thank you all for coming today. What? Wait a minute, why is Gachia here? No, that can't be right, it must be a case of mistaken identity. They say everyone has three lookalikes in the world. Now, let's welcome the bride. Hee <laughs> hee, thank you, everyone. Wow, Kokoa's wedding dress is so cute. It's adorned with lots of lace and ribbons, and the skirt flares out like a princess's. It suits her so well, but wait, that groom is definitely Gachia, isn't it? Kokoa, you look amazing in that dress. No Gacha character can beat you today. You're the cutest in the world. Oh, Gachia. 
Hee <laughs> hee, thank you. You're the most wonderful groom in the world. That smile with the dimples, and a bit of a doll like look when he laughs. It's definitely Gachia. There's no mistake, but who would have thought Kokoa's groom would be Gachia? The groom who entered at the host's queue was none other than Gachia, who had disappeared six years ago. The pain of the day he disappeared came rushing back, and I nearly exploded with anger but managed to hold back. After the ceremony ended and we moved to the reception, I contacted some people. Soon after the reception began. Hey Gachia, what's this wedding all about? What, Dad? A person who vanished after abruptly abandoning his own wedding ceremony and stole three million from our account. How dare you show your face now? Do you know how difficult things were after you disappeared? You caused so much trouble for so many people, and now you're just smiling as if nothing happened. After what you did, you don't get to be happy while everyone else suffers. Ah, uh, what, seriously? Excuse me, who are you? You're not even invited guests, what do you want here? This is the venue for my and Gachia's wedding reception. If you're here to cause a scene, we'll have to take appropriate action. We're sorry for interrupting the reception, but we have our reasons. We are the parents of your groom. Gachia's parents? I heard they disappeared when he was young. Left him behind with debts. Do you know how much he's been hurt by his parents? Don't spread such lies. Disappeared? What are you saying? How can you behave like this towards the parents who raised you? There's a line of decency people should not cross. I don't know these people. Just my luck to have the worst parent gotcha. Why do I have to go through this? Gachia, calm down. I'm here for you. I will protect you. Please stop tormenting him. Leave now. Or you'll end up in a tight spot no gotcha luck can save you from. Wait, Kokoa. You change too much when it comes to Gachia. Calm down. I was the one who called these two here. What? Lisa? What's going on? Why are you connected to these people? Listen carefully, okay? The groom Gachia was my fiancé who disappeared six years ago. These two are definitely Gachia's parents, you can even check with mine if you want. We had finished the marriage introductions and were just about to have the ceremony. What? Lisa's fiancé you talked about is Gachia? What? What's happening? That's not possible, right? To think that I once intended to marry and that person is here now. That's more improbable than pulling an ultra-rare character in a gotcha. Seriously, how optimistic do you have to be to think you can deceive your way out of this situation? It's impossible. The two people confronting Gachia are his parents. Gachia tried to deceive me and his former in-laws, but his attempts were reaching their limits. Wait, wait. Why are Lisa and the others here in the first place? I haven't been in touch with anyone for six years. Kokoa is my friend. Me being here today is truly a coincidence. You were always good at gotcha. It looks like you've hit the ultimate stroke of luck. I found you and called your parents because they've been worried all this time. What's all this about? I quit my job, cancelled my phone, and hid myself thoroughly. And to be discovered today, of all days. What a disaster. Do you think you have the right to be indignant? All you should be doing is apologizing sincerely to Lisa and us, and return the three million you stole. Hey, Gachia. I always believed in you. Even when I saw you arm in arm with another woman on the street, or when I found questionable business cards in your wallet. Wait. You were doing such careless things even while dating Kokoa? It seems this child is no longer the son we knew. Each time, you would say it's a misunderstanding. I'll show you my true self now and then you'd pull a 10-spin gotcha. And whenever you got something incredibly rare, I forgave you. Why does a 10-spin gotcha come into this? I couldn't make heads or tails of that reasoning. Am I the odd one out? No, it's clear as mud to me too. But, Lisa is my irreplaceable friend, and I can't believe she would lie. Please, Gachia, swear on your gotcha luck and tell the truth. Haha, <laughs> sorry, it seems we were not meant to be. I'm off to find my happiness. So long. Wait, what do you mean so long? Wait. How could you, just wait? Like someone's gonna wait just because you say so. Whoa. That's far enough. 
You might have been dodging for six years, but it's time to call it game over. You did something bad, right? Wrongdoings must be accounted for. It's a rule in hero anime. You have to apologize properly. Don't make mama angry. It's scary, you know? Right, Papa? Madison, let's not ask difficult questions. Noah, it looks like I'll need to have a chat with you after this. What? I haven't even said anything. Hey, stop having a lover's quarrel while pinning me down. Who are you? I'm Lisa's husband, Noah. Pleasure to meet you, gotcha guy. I'm Madison, child of Papa and Mama. Nice to meet you. Ha! Huh. Family? What are you talking about? Gachia seemed oblivious to the fact that while he was about to get married, I had already settled down. What are you talking about? That's my line. Do you realize it's been six years? I married the wonderful Noah, and we have this adorable daughter. I'm very happy now. Mama is super kind and a great cook, the best mom ever. Lisa is cute, kind, and very thoughtful. I'm the luckiest man in the world for marrying her. Though you were apologizing profusely just yesterday. Madison, disputes are a part of love and marriage. I love you even when you're getting scolded by Mama, Papa. Don't joke with me. Why are you messing with my happiness then? You could just turn a blind eye. Don't be ridiculous. Kokoa is my dear friend. If I don't protect her, who will? Do you understand how difficult it was back then? I absolutely refuse to let Kokoa be troubled by you. That's right. We had to bow to each guest and pay cancellation fees to the venue. Do you have any idea how much trouble you caused us? Even though I offered to pay, you two insisted on covering everything because it was your son's fault. It was only right as the fault lies entirely with Kachia. He's the one who should take responsibility. What's with that tone? How dare you, my own parents, scold me like this? The one acting inexcusably is you. I can't believe this. I didn't know you were such a person. It seems I was in love with the image of you I had in my mind. I've awakened now. You've got it wrong. They're just envious of our happiness, spreading baseless rumors. We're shining brighter than anyone today, right? Stop with the sugary talk. Excuses are irrelevant now. What matters is why you disappeared six years ago. It was right before the wedding, wasn't it? This isn't a drama. People don't just choose that timing normally. I'm curious about that too. Ah, uh, why does it matter now? It's all in the past. Don't joke around. Do you see how many people you've troubled? You've even turned my precious wedding into chaos. We need to settle this now, tell the truth. Well, I was just thinking about aligning the gotcha. What? What does gotcha have to do with this? So, I proposed to Lisa because I had this fantasy about marriage, but once you're married, you can't play around like before, right? You can't spin the girlfriend gotcha anymore. Girlfriend gotcha? What are you talking about? There's the beautiful type, the soothing type, the natural type. I still hadn't got the cute type. I can't complete the set if I'm married. So I had to flee right before the wedding. Then I met Kokoa, the cute type. I'm super lucky. Is this guy from another dimension? His logic is incomprehensible. Are you an alien? Madison wants to be friends with an alien. As Madison's mother, I firmly veto that idea. As Gachia's parent, I also strongly oppose it. Finally, the reason for Gachia's disappearance became clear, and everyone's distrust only deepened. What an unbelievable reason. I'm glad I found out before our married life began. Indeed. It was tough back then, but I'm relieved I didn't end up marrying him. Now that we're on the subject, why did you steal the three million yen? Look, I embarked on a journey to conquer Gacha. You need money for travel and Gacha, right? Don't ask such beginner questions. Why are you getting mad, especially at your own parents? It's shameful. Of course I'm mad. My wedding got ruined. Do you have any idea what kind of life I've led while on the run? You're curious, aren't you? Want to hear about it? Go on, ask. You really want us to ask, huh? I encountered many romances while fleeing, but eventually, I got tired of them. That's when I met Kokoa and was drawn to her broad-mindedness. I thought I could marry her and be happy, 
But now this. What do you think women are? We're not toys you replace when broken. You're taking proposals too lightly. It's not something to be done over and over. I'm glad such a person isn't my daddy. Your words have tainted even our memories. I don't want to see your face anymore. I wish I could deny the fact that I gave birth to you. What's with everyone? Show some respect for me. The one who deserves sympathy is me, who almost got deceived. I wasted so much time believing in you. But I can save my future. Please, let's call off the engagement. Even you, Kokoa? This can't be happening. What's wrong with me? Wait, my goddess. If you leave, all my struggles, my gotcha journey, will be in vain. If that's what you think, you should have been sincere from the start. Exactly. As of today, we're cutting off our parental ties. We'll be claiming the 3 million yen back, and we'll consult professionals about it. I feel like I've finally settled the matters from six years ago. Meeting here must have been fate. If Lisa's happy, that's all that matters. Yeah, yeah, Mama, let's go home. Hold hands. Damn it! Why does Lisa get to be so happy? Finally, Kokoa and Gachia's engagement was called off. Luckily for Kokoa, she had a particular date in mind for registering the marriage, and thankfully, the wedding ceremony was scheduled earlier. Kokoa was thorough in her actions, confronting Gachia and investigating his past relationships. It turned out that Gachia had borrowed money or swindled and ran off with it from all of his previous girlfriends. The three million yen owed to his in-laws, wedding expenses, and repayments to his past girlfriends amounted to a substantial sum. Unable to secure a stable job after his time on the run, Gachia was left to eke out a living on daily wages, dedicated solely to repaying his debts. As for us. Mama, I want to do gotcha. All right, here's some money. I wonder if I'll get something good. Oh, I got the least wanted one. Gotcha is all about luck, after all. That's true. That's why I think it's best to strive and earn what you truly want. Like how Papa kept pursuing Mama? Why do you know about that? That's a heartwarming turn of events, Lisa. Noah's patience and kindness in giving you the time to heal and trust again truly show his character's strength. And congratulations on your second child. It sounds like your family is filled with love and understanding, ready to embrace the new chapter ahead. Here's to the happy days that await your growing family. If you enjoyed this video, we'd be thrilled if you subscribed to our channel. Subscribing means you'll receive notifications for new videos, keeping you in the loop with all our latest content. Your support is vital to our growth. Let's enjoy and grow together.